When you put the horn up to your lip or in your mouth, that was it. They would not call you. The men felt that this was their domain. To them, a woman, if she's going to do anything in the band, should have been a singer. To be an instrumentalist? No, 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 no. You don't belong in that world. When I was substituting for a man one time, the leader wanted to keep me, and all the men in the band got together and talked the leader out of it. Some of treated us as novelties. It was unusual, and people thought it was cute. The white world was completely unaware of us. Not only we were told, but we knew that we were the best. But we couldn't get that point across because we couldn't play the places that we wanted to play. So this is a woman who worked consistently in a punishing, unforgiving environment. She would write for Tommy Darcy, or Benny Goodman, or whomever. After she'd written it, pow, she went right back down. He was one of the great musicians in jazz, and nobody was paying any attention to her. All I wanted to do was just be one of the guys. That was my fantasy. I did everything that I could possibly think to do to be a good player. And just because of my gender to hear these dumb comments was so aggravating. I knew I was going to play my trumpet some way. The biggest change is the women themselves. We don't walk into the situation concerned about somebody else's baggage about whether we can or we can't. want to be good anyway, but if you're the girl in the band, you have to be.